In this tutorial, what I want to show you is how to take a little thumbnail sketch like this, bring it into Procreate, clean it up, and then bring it into Adobe Illustrator and quickly convert it to a vector graphic. So first you can take a photo of your sketch with your iPad and that ends up in your camera roll. Next you want to go into Procreate and make a new document. I like to do a 4000 by 4000 pixel file and then we can just tap here and then go to add and then insert a photo and we can insert that photo of our sketch. You can also scale it up and then just tap on a different tool to kind of get out of that, that mode there. The next thing you're going to want to do is make a new layer. Tap here to make a new layer. And also let's go back to this layer with a sketch in it. We can turn down the opacity of it. I like to do around 30%. And the next thing you're going to want to do is with your brush, you can use the studio pen. This is a default built in brush that comes with Procreate. And I like to use that just straight out of the box. So no, no adjustments there. And what you're going to want to do here is just start drawing out. Oh, make sure you're in this top layer there. Um, what you're going to want to do is start sketching out your design. Now, if you look at how this wave is drawn, it's pretty much 50, 50 black and white, like, Inside the area of the drawing, it's half white and half black. And I find that is a strong way to make an illustration. It just makes it look a lot more interesting than if, if you were to just use, you know, too much black or too much white. Um, the other thing you can do while you're drawing is if you have kind of a filled in shape, you can just drag in a color. You know, that's not going to work here. But once you have an enclosed area in Procreate, you can fill it in. So I'm just going to draw the rest of this out and then we'll export this and bring it into our desktop computer into Adobe Illustrator. So I've got this drawing done. Let's go into the layers here. I have a few options where I was trying to figure out how much black and white to put in it. And you can do that. You can just draw your image in layers. Um, but you want to make sure to turn off the visibility of that photograph of your sketch. And what we can do now is let's just export this. We can share it as a PNG. And because it's just a black and white file, we can easily just export it as a PNG. That's a flattened file. And I'll just airdrop that to my desktop computer. So now we're in Adobe Illustrator on the desktop. Let's make a new document. And I'll typically do a 4,000 by 4,000 pixel RGB file. Doesn't really matter in this case, but let's just do that. Click Create. So next I'll go File, Place to place that image into our document. And I'll click to place it in and scale it up a little bit. And the next thing we want to do is just click Image Trace. We're just going to use the default Illustrator image trace settings. And the final step here is to click expand. Now it's a vector image. And if I drag it off the artboard here, you'll see it's got the black and the white in it. So let's just double click to isolate that and then use our direct selection tool, our white arrow tool to select some of the white and then select same fill color and just hit delete. So now we just have the black graphic that we made. So that's how to take a rough sketch and turn it into a vector graphic.